Hey lug nuts, welcome to Lug Unplugged. It's me Meredith today here with the Alpine. This is a brand new release from Lug. They released it on their Galentine's show for the first time. They had about 50 of each of the six colors and they sold out in like five minutes. They were so fast. I got two colors. I got the uh, sky, which is this blue and the violet. Neither of them are super bright. The sky's pretty bright. They both, I would say, are more of a saturated look. They really have a good saturated color to them. So I thought I'd show you on the sky because it's a little bit brighter, maybe a little bit easier to see what is going on in this bag. Um, they have since sold it on QVC. I think it's on their website too. So you've got uh, multiple places you can get this, but right now it's only available in the brights collection, which are these kind of highlighter colors. And I would say this is highlighter blue, but it's the super saturated. It's like the, the, the pen itself. It's not the highlighter color. Whereas like the yellow and the pink are definitely more like that bright highlighter color. So interest, this, this bag is interesting because it has this opening that kind of goes from side to side that kind of opens it wide, like a big mouth, like and so it opens really wide, which is really nice to see, but the handle is on the top and so is the crossbody strip. So I wonder when you use it, if the tendency is it's just gonna hang open without much structure to it and to get it zipped without any weight in the bag, it's, it's tricky. It almost takes two hands to zip it up. So um, if you've used it, comment down below and tell me, is, is that something that you find irritating or do you like it? Um, and I'll try and update. Feel free to ask me later, Do I? what did I think about that? Because that, that makes me a little bit wary. I love the way that you'll be able to see into the interior, but the weird way that is open is just kind of odd. There are double zips, which is nice so you can unzip it either direction. Speaking of ways to carry, there's the top handle and the crossbody strap. There is not backpack straps, but I will show you the Dodger. Uh, very similar in size. The Dodger is slightly bigger than the Alpine, but you can see very similar sort of like silhouettes, phone pockets, front pockets, that sort of thing. Um, they both have the top handle. So an interesting comparison if you want to see that. I'll do the video on the Dodger next, but when you're watching this, it'll probably be uploaded. So I'll put that link down below. On the front, you have that signature cell phone pocket with the fleece lining, and then you've got this pocket in the front, which is so cute. It reminds me of like the Jansport backpacks when I was, you know, in, in school. They have these, it's got its own gusset in the front, and so this is just kind of that cool, like all purposes where you put your gum when you're a cool kid um, to, to stay, you know, whatever quick and easy stuff. I would probably put chapstick in here. Chapstick, gum, um, you know, my kids often need band-aids, that sort of thing. I just like the quick and grab um, essentials in there. There's no internal organization in this pocket, but I will point out the large, um, this is the large zipper pull. It's connected here and it's got this lobster claw and that is, the lobster claw is on the bag. So you can collect or you can connect any zipper pull you want or use it without the zipper pull for a different look. I think it's kind of fun. So I'll keep it on, but it's really hard for me not to like, just do this all day. I think that's real fun. Let's do a 360 tour. On the sides, you've got water bottles, holders. They do have magnets that keep them nice and tight so that when you're using it, when you don't have water bottles in, they're not hugely gaping open. So nice, there's one on each side so you can keep it balanced. Um, really cool, I love a good water bottle pocket because that's, if I'm taking it on any sort of excursion or adventure, that's a must. I love a water bottle pocket. The back also has a magnet pocket. It's lined. It has no internal organization either. And it just is the magnet there. All right, let's look at the inside. Here's the lining. Um, I think they could have gone a couple different ways with this. I wish they had used that lining from the... Um, from the Violet Gondola. This is, I don't really care for this diet lining. You know, it's kind of like sketchy flowers and as much as I love sketch as the rest of it, I don't love the white flowers. I don't love the real dark navy background. I think that's navy. So, um, so for the Brights collection, they all have that lining, but it's not my favorite. Honestly, it's, it's just not. Um, you can see here on the back wall, it says, hello, I'm the Alpine underneath the privacy zip pocket. 
that privacy zip pocket is about halfway down the bag. Oh, no, 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 that bag's short. It goes the whole way down. Um, it also does not have any space above the zipper. Beneath it, you have a cargo pocket that also runs the full length of the bag, nice and sizable. But I said this in another video, sometimes when that cargo pocket's so big and you just toss something in the bag, it automatically goes in the cargo pocket instead of in the main interior. So you have to watch that. The front side has a clear view zipper pocket. It is not divided. It also goes to, uh, goes to the bottom. It goes about an inch from the bottom if I'm looking there. And then on the side, they just have a clip, a clip for keys, your wallet, whatever. Um, but there's no clip itself. It's just like the D-ring. So you can clip something on there um, really easy, but it doesn't come with the clip. Okay, I missed on this wall so interestingly they're using all four walls this back wall has the privacy pocket and the cargo pocket this wall has the key d-ring this wall has the clear view and then this side wall has two pen holders you see that right there one yeah one two pen holders right along that side wall sorry guys it's hard to <laughs> there two pen holders so they really kind of use the 360 of this bag on the inside and the out sometimes they forget about they don't forget people don't use the side of bags because there's just not usually much they usually have that triangle shape so it's wide at the bottom narrow at the top and so there's not room to use it this is one where they really do maximize every square inch of the bag no feet no wipeable bottoms at all um but Really, you know, honestly, I'm excited about this bag. I'm excited about how it will um, how it'll work for me, and the bright colors just are really a great way to usher into spring. I'm, I'm eager to use it. I wasn't sure I was gonna keep them both because I wasn't sure if I needed to, but the colors are so beautiful. How do you not keep them, right? Thanks for watching. Did you get an Alpine? What color did you get? Are you liking the Brights collection? Comment down below. I always love to hear from you. Thanks for watching.